What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Friend and welcome back to another Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl Guide video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to attain the two mythical Pokemon, Jirachi and Mew, right after you receive your first badge and made your way to, what is the name of this town? This is Flormoral Town? I'm probably saying that wrong. Let me know in the comment section below. But once you've gotten to this town, all you need to do is make your way to these two beautiful couple right here standing in the flowers and you'll be able to attain a Mew and a Jirachi. Now the only requirements to this is that you actually need a save file of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu or Pokemon Let's Go Eevee on your Nintendo Switch and a save file from Pokemon Sword or Pokemon Shield on your Nintendo Switch. You don't need both, you don't need Sword and Shield or Pikachu and Eevee. All you need is one, and it doesn't really matter what profile as well. As long as it detects the save file on the Switch itself, you should be fine. Do note that you're only able to receive these gifts once, so you're not able to just create multiple save files and collect multiple versions of Mew and Jirachi. You're only able to grab these guys once and save them once, so let's go grab the Mew and Jirachi now. It says, hello there. Well, it looks like you played Let's Go in Kanto before. Would you like to go on an adventure in Sinnoh with this Pokemon? You attain the Mew. So we got ourselves the Mew right here. And again, pretty cool. I believe it's at level one, but we're going to check the status and moves right after this. It says, it's sure to be a good partner to you. And then you go to the guy right here and he's going to say, oh, you there. I gather you've seen a wishing star before. Would you mind taking this Pokemon? I think it would be perfect for you. You attained a Jirachi. Again, a Pokemon I actually never used during my playthrough, so I think this is going to be a pretty good one. It says, Jirachi has been added to your party. It says, I wish you and this Pokemon the grandest of adventures together. So now that we got both of them, let's go to our Pokemon in our party. And yep, Mew is at level 1. Let's look at the stats in the no Pokedex number. Level 1 doesn't have move. It's a Kirky Mew. Doesn't have really crazy stats. It says Pound and Reflect. Now let's check Jirachi. He got Confusion and Wish. Now again, I never played a playthrough with Mythical Pokemon on my team. However, considering they at such a low level, I might keep them on my team for a while just to try them out. I know a lot of people are saying that that's gonna make the games feel incredibly broken or make the games easier. However, I am just trying to push through these games to get to the end content so I can grind out a lot of stuff at the end game as well. So I, I, I might keep these guys around just for a little bit to see if I'm able to use them as my advantage through the story. But let me know your thoughts of getting a Jirachi and a Mew very early on in the game. Again, all I have is one badge. So I think th for some Pokemon players, this is, you know, this is cool. This is okay. But I think that's going to make a lot of people feel like, hey, like we shouldn't be able to attain these Pokemon with just granting or getting one badge. But to each his own, let me know what you're gonna do with your two gift Pokemon, Mew and Jirachi. Are you gonna just throw them in a the box or are you gonna keep them on your team? rocking let me know those move sets as well like always guys i answer all comments so let's have that conversation down there if you're new around here consider hitting that subscribe button i do videos like this every day talking pokemon mario call of duty or fortnite wherever i feel like dropping the vibes on i drop it here on the channel so again consider hitting that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as moving the videos into recommended so other people can check out the videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one thank you thank you thank Thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you're not a subscriber and you made it this far, hit that subscribe button. You know you want to join the family, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop one of my videos, as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family. If you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok or whatever, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on all of those. Again, Daddy Gamer Fred, you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment 
on my Twitter. Also on all of my videos, I do answer all comments. So again, if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything, just hit me up in the comment section below. I take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and I love it. And again, let's have that conversation down there. Here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest. I am a variety channel. I do tons of stuff, tons of Pokemon, but tons of other stuff as well. So dive into these videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.